Hi, my name is Crystal Gomez. I'm one of the attorneys with Lincoln Goldfinch Law. Today we're talking about what adjustment of status is and how we know if we're eligible for it. Adjustment of status is the process by which people can change their status from, let's say, a visa holder, maybe they're undocumented or maybe their visa is expired, to being someone who is a permanent resident of the United States. There's a few different avenues that one can take in order to go through this process, and there's different eligibility requirements for each process. One of the most common ways that people adjust their status is when they're petitioned for by a family member. If your family member is petitioning you, let's say it's your spouse or your child who's over 21 years of age, and you wanna know, is this something that you can do? Can you go all automatically to the part where you get to apply for your legal permanent residence? There are a few different things we need to look at to determine your eligibility. One is the way that you entered the United States. If you entered the United States with a visa, and you're an immediate relative of a United States citizen, your spouse, your child, who's over 21, um, if you're under 21, your parent, who's a US citizen. In those situations, yes, we can apply for what's called a one-step application. We apply for your family petition and your green card application all at the same time. If your spouse is a legal permanent resident or your parent is a legal permanent resident, it changes the equation a little and you have to still be in status, in a legal status in the United States in order to apply for your permanent residence and your visa has to be available. If you did not enter the country lawfully, if you entered without inspection, then you're going to have to do what's called the consular process in most of the situations with a family member petitioning for you. This means you might need a waiver, you're gonna to have to go to your home country in order to do your application there, and it's not just filing for adjustment of status in the US. There are some other different kinds of case types that can just adjust status despite the fact that they, that person might have entered unlawfully. Violence Against Women Act applications, so if you're a victim of domestic violence or abuse, or if you're a victim of crime, people who've had their U visa for three years can then apply for adjustment of status afterwards. It's complicated, just like everything in immigration law. Um, if you're wondering whether you have a situation where you can apply for adjustment of status, please reach out, contact us at Lincoln Goldfinch Law, and we're happy to walk you through and find out about your particular case and whether you are eligible or not. Mm -hmm.